Hello buddy, Keith Collins, Finance America. Today I want to talk a little bit about jumbo loans. Going to read it and give you my, de my, my description. Jumbo loan, a loan that exceeds the lending limits established by Fannie Mae and Freddie Mac for conforming loans, aka non-conforming. So in lending, whether we're doing an FHA, a VA, or a conforming loan like a Fannie Mae or Freddie Mac loan, we have a backing from some entity, whether it's the federal government because it's Fannie Mae or Freddie Mac, or, or FHA or VA. In a jumbo loan standpoint, when it's above the loan limit set by these entities, okay, contact your lender because in each area that limit can be different. But when it exceeds that limit, it's considered a jumbo home loan. And essentially it's a portfolio loan that the lender is doing because there's no government-backed agency insuring the mortgage. So it's a little riskier, usually the interest rate's a little bit higher. And sometimes the guidelines that we set forth on jumbo home loans might be a little bit more restrictive or harder to accomplish. For example, things like reserves. Usually on jumbo home loans, lenders require a little bit more reserves than they would on an FHA or, 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 or a Fannie Mae, Freddie Mac type loan. What are reserves? Reserves are the ability to make your mortgage payment out of some sort of account, asset account, for a period of time. So six months reserves would be six months of the payments and savings after the close of escrow. No, there's no problem with the jumbo home loan. They're readily available. We have 20 or 30 different lenders that do jumbo home loans. You just have to understand that there might be some differences and each lender can be uniquely different. Give me a call if you have any questions. Keith Collins, Finance of America.